we call these uh, sgraffitos. And uh, this is a blank. It's really just a board covered many times with layers of India, India ink. This is how they look and this is how I purchased them. Um, I used to, before these were, were made readily for artists, I, uh, I used to cover a board with ink myself and, uh, and cut away the ink. And, and that's really what it is. I, I consider it a, uh, <clears throat> a one-of-a-kind etching and uh, the, the, the board is black. I, uh, I just take a sharp instrument. My, my favorite is just a simple X-Acto knife. And I cut away the, the darks. I work creating light, really. Um, and uh, you can do extreme detail, which is what I like. And I love uh, etching techniques. Um, really because of Whistler and Rembrandt, who were, I consider, and Picasso, the greatest etchers. Um, but these are even more special because you're not making an addition. I'm not carving into a copper plate. I'm, uh, I'm carving into a, uh, a black surface and uh, creating this one-of-a-kind print. Not even a print, an original. It's not a print, it's an original. And this is a uh, another one that's further along. You just cut away the uh, the light. The color is done with washes, really thin washes of acrylic paint, which is quite permanent. And and then I put a coat of varnish over each uh, each one to protect it for eons and uh, protect it from UV. You can see how the, uh, using usually cross -hat hatching techniques, but, but it's a, sort of an age old style done in a modern way.